Discovering new things is great. I wonder what that's like for a chemistry expert. Let's call one. So my name is Dr. Jonathan Foster. I'm a, a researcher at the University of Sheffield in the chemistry department. So I'm a scientist. I, uh, I wear a white coat and I work at a fume hood. And my job is to discover new things about the universe. Um, and in particular, to try and make new materials. So uh, the materials that we make uh, are uh, just a single layer of atoms thick. Um, and that means that they're really useful for uh, making solar cells, uh, for cleaning water, uh, and for making new types of uh, chemicals in a more efficient way. So I can profoundly remember various points in my career where I made, I had one of those eureka moments and I could, uh, I, I discovered something new that had never been discovered before. And I was so excited to tell people about it and uh, ran off immediately and, and showed all my friends uh, the, the new materials that I'd made. But actually science quite often isn't like that. Uh -huh. I discover new things every day, but a lot of the time you kind of get, get used to it and uh, it's just part of it. And also it's, it's very much a team effort you're working with colleagues, you're solving problems, you're making little discoveries. Um, it's kind of like climbing up a hill. Um, so, you know, you put one foot in front of the other um, and you're kind of focused on the, the sort of the next steps. Um, but then every so often you kind of look back and you can see the whole view spread out in front of you. You can see the progress that you've made uh, and you get those sort of really wow moments. And I think discovering Jesus is, is very similar. So a lot of the time you kind of just walking with Jesus, it, it feels every day, you know, you're dealing with the problems of life. Um, but then every so often you, you kind of look back and you get a different perspective and you can kind of see where the path that you've taken has led you um, or, and you get a new perspective on, on, on where it is that you've, that you've come. Thanks, Jonathan. What a wow moment. I wonder if you've ever looked back at your life to see where you've come from. 